26. Secret run commands to access hidden tools and setters in Windows 10 or 11. Press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open the run dialog box. First on our list is the computer management MSC command. This command opens the computer management console, a comprehensive tool that consolidates various administrative utilities in one place. It provides access to multiple system tools such as disk management, events viewer, device manager, and services, streamlining system administration. The disk management allows you to manage disk partitions, format drives, and assign disk letters, helping you organize and optimize storage in your system. The event UI enables you to view and analyze system logs and events, aiding in troubleshooting and diagnosing system issues by providing detailed error and warning messages. The device manager offers a way to view and manage hardware devices, update drivers, and resolve hardware-related problems, ensuring that all components function properly. User and group management allows for the creation and management of local user accounts and groups, including certain permissions and account policies, which is useful for maintaining system security. The service control tool provides easy access to start, stop, and configure system services, similar to services.msc command, allowing you to control which services run on your system. The task scheduler integrates with task scheduler, enabling the automation of tasks such as backups, maintenance, and script execution, which helps maintain system efficiency. Next is the F squared command. This opens the Bluetooth file transfer wizard, which facilitates the transfer of files between your computer and other Bluetooth-related devices and simplifies the process of sending and receiving files via Bluetooth, making it straightforward to transfer documents, photos, and other files between your computer and Bluetooth-enabled devices. Next is the MSTSC command. This command opens the remote desktop connection utility, which allows you to connect to and control a remote computer over a network. It enables you to access and control a remote computer as if you were sitting right in front of it, making it easier to manage or troubleshoot systems from a distance. Next is the Winva command. This displays the Windows version and build information in the dialog box. It assists in troubleshooting by providing specific version and build information, which can be essential when seeking support or resolving issues with software or hardware compatibility. Next is the Perform MSC command. It opens the Performance Monitor, a powerful tool for monitoring and analyzing the performance of your Windows system. This provides a real-time data on various system metrics such as CPU, memory, disk, and network usage, allowing you for in-depth performance analysis. The next command we have is the msconfig command. It opens the system configuration utility, providing a user-friendly interface to manage startup programs, boot options, and system services. This tool helps improve system performance by allowing users to disable unnecessary startup items and troubleshoot boot issues, making it easier to control what runs on your computer. Next is the CMD command. This command opens the command prompt, a powerful command line interface in Windows that allows direct interaction with the operator system through commands, providing greater control over system tasks and setters. Now we have the sysprep command. This opens the system preparation tool, a utility designed for advanced users and IT professionals. It prepares Windows installation for imaging and deployment, enabling the creation of a standardized system image that can be employed across multiple computers. Next, we have the control user passwords through command. It opens the user accounts window with advanced options for managing user accounts and settings, including the ability to set up automatic login, manage account passwords, and configure user privileges. Next on our list is the OSK command. 
this command opens the on-screen keyboard an accessibility tool in windows it allows you to use a virtual keyboard displayed on your screen enabling typing with a mouse or other pointing device when the physical keyboard is not available or functional next is the shell font command this opens the fonts folder in windows it provides a centralized view of all fonts installed in your system allowing you to quickly browse and manage them next the component service command which opens the component service window a management console for configuring and managing component object model applications and services on your windows system allowing you to control how these components interact with applications and services on your system next on our list is the rstrui command which opens the system restore utility a tool for reverting your system to a previous state it allows you to restore your system to a previous point in time which can be helpful if you encounter system issues after recent changes such as software installations or updates now we have the chart map command this opens the character map tool which provides access to a wide range of special characters and symbols not readily available on the keyboard it displays characters from various fonts installed in the system helping you explore and utilize different typographic styles and glyphs for creative or professional purposes next on the list is the appways the cpl command this command opens the programs and features window, which allows you to manage installed software on your Windows system. It also provides access to options to change, repair, or update installed programs, helping to fix issues or add new features. Next is the Rigidit command, which opens the Registry Editor, a powerful tool for viewing and modifying the Windows registry. This allows for deep customization of system settings that are not accessible through the standard user interface, giving you greater control by your system. Next, we have the Tax Manager command which opens the Tax Manager, a crucial tool for monitoring and managing your system's performance and processes. This command allows for you to view and manage valid processes, enabling you to end unresponsive applications and free up system resources. Next on our list is the NCPA CPL command, which opens the Network Connections window, providing access to manage network interfaces and settings on your Windows system. It allows you to view and manage all network connections, including Ethernet, Wi-Fi, and VPN and adapters, enabling quick access to network settings. Now we have the, the gbedit.msc command. This opens the local group policy and is only available on some versions of Windows. It enables the implementation of security policies such as password requirements, account lockout thresholds, and firewall settings to protect your system from unauthorized access and potential threats. Next is the calc command, which opens the calculator app, a versatile tool for performing various types of calculations. It offers modes for scientific calculations, including trigonometry, logarithms, and exponentiation, making it suitable for more complex mathematical tasks. Next on our list is the MS Paint command. This opens the Microsoft Paint, a simple and intuitive graphics editor included with Windows. It provides essential tools for basic image editing tasks, such as cropping, resizing, rotating, and drawing, making it easy to quickly modify images without needing advanced software. Next is the Power CMG CPL command, which opens the Power Option settings, where you can manage and customize power plans and settings for your Windows system. It allows you to create, modify, and select power plans to optimize your system's energy usage based on your needs, whether you are aiming for performance, energy efficiency, or a balanced approach. The next command is the Snipping Tool command, which opens the Snipping Tool a built-in utility for capturing screenshots on Windows. It provides multiple modes for capturing screenshots, including freeform, rectangular, window, and full-screen snips, catering to various needs. Next, CTG command, which opens the clear type text tuner, a tool for optimizing text display on LCD screens. It helps you adjust clear type settings to enhance the readability and sharpness of text on LCD displays, making it easier to read and reduce eye strain. Next on our list is the ODB CAD32 command, 
This OP is the ODBC Data Source Administrator, a tool used for managing database connections in Windows. It allows you to configure and manage the open database connectivity data sources, which are essential for connecting applications to data. Lastly, we have the Notepad command. This opens the Notepad, a simple and versatile text editor included with Windows. It comes pre-installed on all Windows systems, ensuring you always have access to a basic text editor without needing to install additional software.